Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, and I've got some sad, sad news for y'all today. And it's actually just, just breaking news, actually. This is breaking news. I was at 98 subs, and I lost one. Went down to 97. I wanted to cry for a little bit. I sat in a corner, thumb in my mouth, just contemplating life. No, I'm just kidding. I mean, it sucks to lose somebody, but hey, I'm not for everybody, just like everybody's not for me. It is what it is. It's cool. But I'm going to get there. We ain't quitting. So I'm browsing through my, my timeline or whatever and my suggested videos, and I see this Machine Gun Kelly sings for Shy Little Fan and hugs her. So I'm super curious about this. I want to see it. I love stuff like that. You know what I mean? I mean, let's see it. Let's see what this is about. Okay, let's sing her a song and see if we can bring her out of the show real quick. Okay, so, so it looks like I hit this late. And he said, let's sing her favorite song and let's try to break her out of her shell. So I don't know if she's sitting there like hiding behind somebody or, but it looks like she's way up close wherever he's at. Um, if you guys know where this is at, let me know. I mean, I don't know the size of this place. It doesn't look like it's, I mean, I can't tell. I can't tell how big it is. We'll just put it there. Let's keep going. Got the staff back, and it feels good. So you come back, and you and I, and we're both wild. And the night's young, and your mind's rough, bring you into my face now. See, that's cool. Um, this scene right here reminds me of um, a movie from, I think, like 1985 or 1984. And it's probably a movie you guys have never heard of. I mean, ever. It's called Buckaroo Banzai. Um, I know, right? Weird. But it's got a bunch of, you know, um, young stars at the time, like Peter Weller, I think his name is, the guy who played the original RoboCop. It's got John Lithgow. If you don't know who Lithgow is, look him up. When you see his face, you look, oh, I know him from something. Um, it's got the guy from, gosh, he, Jeff Goldblum's in it. Um, but the basis of the movie is this guy, Buckaroo Banzai is his name, he is a quote unquote superhero in a way. Uh, the thing is, is it's like he's he's a super like super secret agent. He is a world famous rock star. He's like a world renowned physicist, scientist, whatever, um, inventor, and and he fights crime. He's all this weird stuff. And the movie is just weird. Well, anyways, in the movie. Um, He's singing, and his and he's in his band, and they're doing their thing, and they're going, and then all of a sudden, he stops the music dead, right in its tracks, because he hears a lady crying all the way across the room in the back, sitting at a table by herself crying, and he stops the music, talks to her a little bit, and then sings a song just for her, and I don't know why, but that's exactly the feeling I got right here when I saw this, and when I heard that, you know, that's, so, check out Buckaroo Banzai, it's crazy, I'm telling you, it's stupid, but it's stupid funny. It's one of those B movies from the 80s, but man, it's funny. Check this out. Let's go. Let's get back to this. Come on, dude. Keep going back and forth. Let's see her. Let's see her break out of her show. Oh, okay, I recognize it now. Bad things. We did bad things. <laughs> Come on, is she out of her shell yet? Where are we going? Okay, if that won't break her out of her shell, I don't know. <laughs> oh, okay. No, he didn't. Yeah. 
shut that down. I don't know what that is, but listen, that was amazing. It's stuff like that. I mean, it got me a little teary eyed because I, I have such a soft spot for kids, but I, I that's amazing. He didn't have to do that at all. Does he doesn't have to? He doesn't have to care, and he does. That was amazing, and um, and I think the girl was more. I think it was more the crowd than it was MGK. And I wonder, I wonder if maybe he got her off to the side with the family or something afterwards. I don't know. But that would have been pretty awesome if he did. But that was cool. I'm glad we got to react to that. So um, there you go, guys. I'm glad I saw it. It actually made me feel really good inside. And this is going to be a good night. So hopefully you enjoyed that too. Uh, the name is Humbled Mumbles. And um, hit my subscribe button, guys. Hit my like button. Hit the notification bell. And until I see you again, goodbye.